your hands ready. Ready? Fry or a piece. How many? Four. Good job. High five, everyone. High five. Boop. Don't leave me hanging. High five. Oh, awesome. Okay, so this is called my notebook. This is where I write everything I need to do. Now, don't judge me on my writing, but look, this is my list of priorities that I need to do. And as I complete them, I cross them off. Okay? So what kind of sentence will we be able to write for this? I'm going to share mine, and then you can share yours. My priorities are to go to blank and complete my homework. Where would I go? Home. Not home. Well, yeah. My pro that's a good one. My priorities are to go home and complete my homework. Or what else can we put in there? My homework is important. But where's the word priorities? Think about it. My priorities are to go to school. I can fill it in with school and complete my homework when I get home. So what would you write? What are your priorities? It could be things you have to do when you get home. So when I was your age, my priorities was to get out of school, go home, get a snack, do my homework, and then do my chores, and then get ready for bed. And I got to watch a little bit of TV. So I knew those were the things that I needed to complete that day, right? So what are your priorities? While you're writing, tell me some of your priorities. What are your priorities you have to do every day? I have to wash the dishes. Wash the dishes. How about yours? What do you have to do? What is your priorities? What, what are your priorities today? So you need to go to school. Well, first you need to get up, brush your teeth, wash your face, eat some breakfast, come to school. What else do you have to do? Yeah, oh, you have chores. Okay. How about you? Well, don't write on the eraser, please. Do you have homework after class? Yes or no? I can't hear you. Yes. Okay. How about you? You have to feed your dog. Oh, that is a big priority, because if you don't feed that dog, they're not going to be happy, right? Okay, this is our last one. Do anyone know what our last word is? Resistance. That's a nice try. Anyone else would like to try? Okay, residence. What does the word resident mean? Where you live, and it is a noun. A place where someone lives. Okay? Okay, let's clap it out. It's our last one. Ready? Resident. How many syllables? Three. 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 How many? Three. 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 Good. So let's read the sentence. Who can read that for me? The first one. This is their residence. What about the... This is... This is, this is, mm -hmm. good job. Thank you for reading that. So, do all our residents look exactly the same? Yeah. Now, I'm not very, I'm, no, let's talk about it. I'm not an artist, I tried my best, but everyone resident may look different. Some people may live in a what? A house. A house. Some may live in a house with, yeah, could be an apartment. And I drew right here, first floor, second. So where I live, in El Grove, all the apartments have three floors. And some have four. So they're like stacked on top of each other in our city. My house is a one-story house with no stairs. Then there might be a house with stairs inside, right? Or... Some people live in what? You could drive them. Hotel. Oh, oh, I didn't think about that one. Some people live in hotels. Those little houses are Like a trailer or a camper. Good. What else? A, a mansion. A boat. Yeah, some people live in mansions. I wish I had a mansion, but I don't. But I'm happy with what I have. Some people live in boat houses. 
I met this lady and she was like, oh, come over, we're gonna stop and pick up these papers. And she lived in a boathouse on the water. A shelter? Some people live in shelters. Like back in the day, people lived in caves? Right, back in the day, they didn't have nice little houses with roofs and chimneys and things like that. There were caves, you're correct. So for my sins, I wrote, my residence is in a house. A house. Or Elk Grove. A cottage. Could be a cottage. Yes. So where's your residence? What would you write for your sentence? He did. 